Hello and welcome to my food channel. Um, today we're going to be making some uh, beef and mushroom pie with a bit of some leeks in there. So we're going to sweat off the leeks and a bit of butter, add the mushrooms and the beef and then a little bit of Worcester sauce and some Mrs Rogers beef seasoning. Then I'm going to use some phyllo pastry to make our pies and I've got some little little pie dishes here non-stick and they work very very well. So let's get these leeks on um, I'll come back in a minute and show you what's sizzling and then we will put the um, beef pies together. Right so what I've done here is I'm just sweating down the leeks and the mushrooms once I've done that, I'm going to remove them and uh, then I'm going to brown the mints. Because um, if I put the mints in now, I'm going to overcook those vegetables. Okay, we've got all the um, mints and the leeks and the mushrooms, um, Worcester sauce, etc. I've also put a couple of teaspoons of pesto in there. Um, just to thicken it up a bit. Um, I haven't put any water in. <coughs> and now we've got the phyllo pastry. And I'm just going to brush these outside bit, bits because we're going to fold them in over the top in a minute. So let's just uh, spoon some of this mixture in. The colour is <laughs> great, I've got to say but the flavour is amazing um, and phyllo pastry in a pie is, is just a die for alright so you've probably seen this in the quiche recipe if you've been watching my channel but just fold these over and rather than having a separate piece of pastry as your top uh, this is a, a nice way of doing this has probably got way too much pastry on it, but um, I don't think um, I or anybody else is going to complain about that. And there you go, that's ready to go in the oven. So I'm going to do some more of these and then uh, once I've cooked them, I'll take them out of the oven and you can sit there and drool <laughs> while I eat them. <laughs> And there you have it. There's the pies all looking nice and golden. And I can't wait to get stuck into them. Um, the recipe will be underneath the video um, with all the ingredients in there. Um, please um, give it a go. These pie dishes here, these are non-stick. So you don't have to grease them ever. They're fantastic. I strongly recommend them. Okay, I hope you enjoy making your pies and I'll catch you on the next recipe.